we're back to what? Fuck. We're back to watch <laughs> season one, <laughs> episode again. two of Breaking Bad, The Cats in the Bag. Oh, okay. Um, yeah. So we just finished watching the pilot. And whoa, 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 ew. Sorry. That, what kind of little demon gremlin grumble was that? I don't know. Oh. We'll figure it out. You guys got to we'll do that. <laughs> I just wanted to so you guys didn't see We accidentally that. watched the first and second, uh, guys. But yeah, so we just finished watching the pilot. Very, very insane. Um, wow. And if you haven't been with us from day one, Nahid and Marquetta have seen it. Rana and I have not. So, yeah. Um, well, yeah. And well, if you didn't <laughs> watch the reaction, go watch it now. It's available. Yeah, if you oh, guys... Yeah. By the way, guys, like we were saying earlier, remember, and this is not a market substitute for the actual video. Please watch it with your friends before watching with us. Watch on Netflix. Most of you guys have already seen this, so I don't know why we keep saying this, but I'll probably repeat that a hundred more times. It's all good. <laughs> and yes, uh, please check out our Patreon for early access and our uncuts of this. But yeah, let's start this thing then. Yeah, because after this. the last episode, we're going right into it. I yeah. don't have a whole lot yeah. to say. I just want to say, the last episode play. Went you guys have any predictions? You guys have any predictions? Um, oh, predictions. Those are important. The wife is Skylar. It's like, where'd you get this money? Yeah, we have to. He <laughs> took not even $7,000, all of the money they had, he yeah. took and put it towards this RV, yeah. which I think he just fucking wrecked. Like, I don't know if that still works. Yeah, but I think that they still got out and. Like green numbers. And and the hey, money. He, he has money you now. Like you guys saw that money. Yeah. Yeah. Time. So yeah. he could literally. <laughs> <laughs> um, or or this guy could be like, where have you been? And he'll be like, I have cancer. Cats, I, cats in the bag. I don't yeah. think he's gonna. Well, cats and cats out of the bag is usually well, yeah, like somebody finds out the secret. Yeah, never mind. So I think he's gonna keep the un secret until he can't anymore. Until he's so physically just worn down that you can look at somebody and be like. He'll leave it in his don't will. Look good. <laughs> yes. Yeah, it's, you, guys, you guys are very observant. Let's see what happens. Let's do this. <laughs> you had time to get a bulldozer, but you didn't have time to get pants? Too. That's clearly not gonna happen. <laughs> oh my god, are they alive, bro? I thought it was one whiff and you're dead. They took hella whiffs. Yeah. Oh, you did it once already. Yeah, right. Finish the job, I guess. Oh my god, Jesse. Yeah. Listen, uh, I am having breakfast with my family right now, and I, I really don't appreciate these sales calls. He's still not dead. I wouldn't oh. put my ear to the RV. I can hear him, like, rolling around in there, all right? Calm down. Are you going to help me clean this up? I'll be there after school. Catch you, man. Calling sick. Uh, listen, uh, that is just not going to work for me. I'm, I'm not interested in that at all. And, she knows uh, he's lying. You don't have to. So annoying, those people. Why are they awkward now? You guys have passionate sex. Well, she knows he's he's hiding something. Yo, 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 one, four, eight, three to the three to the six to the nine, representing the ABQ. What up, biatch? Leave it to <laughs> <laughs> What up, biatch? Oh, no. Mm. You was fucked. Why would you not lock it? Oh my god. Oh. So fucked up. Yeah, that's gotta be. Hey, listen. No, 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 no! <laughs> Can't see. Oh my god, so fucked. <laughs> I like the song choices. <laughs> Damn, there you go. He got so lucky he drove by him. He's got his own side. Seriously, this is so stupid. 
fine herbage, yes. keeping it real. <laughs> the streets, yo. <laughs> oh, man. He is capable of acting out of mutual self-interest. Yes. No. What? No, man. Do you think he you have to kill is him? capable of listening to reason? No. no. What, what kind of reason? You mean like, dear Tracy Eight, hey, listen, if I let you go, will you promise not to come back and waste my entire family? No Colombian neckties? You mean that kind of reason? <laughs> no, man, I can't say as I have high fucking hopes for that's concern. Yeah. What's that? Oh. Torturing this human. Oh, I didn't yeah. kill him. Honestly, that that would be the humane thing to do at this point. Therefore, it seems to me that our best course of action would be chemical disincorporation. Oh my god! Yep, that's what all this that acid was for. Strong acid. Yeah, I'm with you. Not, uh, you're not serious. I'm serious as a heart attack. I guess the only other fair way to go about this would be one of us deals with the body situation while the other one of us deals with the crazy eight situation. I want to be honest. I wouldn't let him deal with anything on his own. Uh -huh. he, he, I've, I've already just been like, bro, you made us do this. You deal with it all. In a scenario like this, I don't suppose it is bad form to just... The coin. <laughs> that's what the heat would do. Shit, that's what I was thinking. Now, what kind of plastic, man? Polyethylene. Well, how the hell am I supposed to? I know. Why send because him? I, I don't know, man. This feels kind of flimsy. If any decent ass is gonna eat right through this. Shut up. Oh, no, I just look. You skipped, clowned around, or otherwise jerked off through every lecture I ever gave. As far as I'm concerned, your chemistry education is over. Oh, okay. Be a dick about it. <laughs> <laughs> so, hey, have you, um... Have you done that? I hate how they always like, talk on the phone. Stop it. No, it was me. I'm just trying to think of it like I was... I was doing him a favor. Yeah. At the stage in the game you are. This much water. What? Is that a PM? But how? Hopefully, he can like shimmy his way up the pole. Is this something like his brother or I mean, like his son or something? Well, I think in a way it still humanizes him. Oh. I feel so bad for this guy. I mean, he was a ruthless little fucking dealer before this. So. Yeah. Crown it was right? either kill him or die because they were gonna kill him. Yeah. Even if you know, teaching him the recipe didn't keep you alive long enough for them to learn it. No. <laughs> You're not. He's right. You need to try to get high. Yeah. Oh. Nah. You're wasting it. <laughs> <laughs> ah. You should have doubled it. Your face! We all been there. Maybe not with the joint, but we all been there. <laughs> Love. 
great for your lungs. Yeah, it needs edible weed. So, who's up for Nelly? Shit, let me know, fam. I wanna know what it is, fam. Yeah, if I was him, I'd wanna know. Girl. Girl. Oh. You sure? Pretty sure. Can I tell you this exactly what something? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, can you remember you said that when she's 16 and starts dating? Oh, he won't. Mm. Exactly. Tell her! That's the thing that, like, what if she starts pushing for chemo and all the things that he doesn't want to do? Because at least right now he's sick, but he has some kind of quality mm. of life. Alright, you're not acting obviously. Something's wrong. Who's Jesse Pigman? <gasps> Who is this Jesse Pigman to you? He sells me pot. What are you, like 16 years old? Your brother-in-law is a DEA agent. What, what is wrong with you? myself lately, but I love you. Nothing about that has changed. Nothing ever will. So right now, what I need is for you to climb down out of my ass. Can you do that? Damn! Oh my god. Please. Can you do that? Can you do Just that once. Me? Get off my ass. I'd appreciate it. I really would. <laughs> Damn. So nicely though. That is years and years of resentment right there. Yeah. I mean, let us walk his pot, woman. <laughs> God, I love this show. So much of rotten Fuck meat. Fuck, I love this show. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Could you be any more obvious? <laughs> Oh, oh my, my god! god. Oh, fuck. <gasps> she, you asked very nicely to get off his ass. Like seriously, Excuse what? Me. <laughs> Excuse me. You. Yes, you. May I talk to you? <laughs> Bro. You didn't lock your gate. Oh, Wait, whatever you're selling, I ain't buying, yo. My name is Skylar White, yo. <laughs> My husband is Walter White. Yo. Yo. Oh my God. Uh huh. He told me everything. No. Seriously. My brother-in-law is a DEA agent, and I will not hesitate to call him. Not if I have to. Girl, you're crazy. Okay. Stay out of his business. This is your do not sell marijuana to my husband. Fuck you. Okay. I won't call our house again. You stay away from him, or you will be one sorry individual. Um, no more marijuana. I can, I can dig it. This guy is really annoying. I know, like... And it's like, I get it, you're pregnant and hormonal and... Like, that it does affect you in, in a weird way. Well, like, don't go balls out. Not that it's any of my business, but... <laughs> you might want to consider a different line of work. Okay. What so you might want to consider is a chain for that fence. I love him. <laughs> Back to hitting my, it. He's my favorite person in the world. He's my favorite too. I love him. Your friendly neighborhood meth head. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do it you in the bathroom. That's going to eat your tub up, bro. One is completely my responsibility. Hell, oh, let's just let him live down there. Just, I don't know. Make sure to. Feed him like three times a day. <laughs> At least he's taking precautions. I don't know, melting bodies. This is so disgusting. Why? Try dragging 200 pounds of stink up a flight of stairs. I barely got him in the bathtub. Bathtub. Yup. You know, that's another Is thing. that gonna like burn everything? Town, that so will disintegrate that tub. But I have a perfectly good tub I can use. Your tub's gone. 
and you can't what drain it down the pipes like oh you didn't think this through man Jesse to do anything. <laughs> I know that feeling. I'm just kidding. Oh. You guys gotta understand. Jesse is Jesse. He you he's your him. friendly neighborhood method. <laughs> <And Like, laughs> drug dealer too. He tried to get the job done, but you know he half assed it. And you know, but like I give him props for you know getting it done though. Dra- dragging 200 pounds of steam yeah. up a flight of stairs. That is a an accomplishment in its own right. I would have never done it. I would just went to jail like, fuck all this I don't think that dude was no 200 pounds. I think he was over-exaggerating that shit like a motherfucker. No, it could do well. Muscle was, weighs more yeah. than fat. True. Yeah. That <laughs> body and everything. Yeah, yeah. yeah you guys are right. right. No. Fuck Skylar. So, yeah, well, yeah, so my question is, what do you guys think about Skylar, if anything, right now? I don't know, man. I know she's trying to be a good wife and you know what I mean? Like... And but put herself I don't know, like she's not his mom. But put herself in your in her position. You guys know what's going on with Walter. Alright. Let's say you guys didn't know what was going on with Walter. What if I was her and I'm like, alright, the guy's acting weird and he admitted he was smoking weed, but I'm like, alright though, why are you smoking the weed though? I need a reason. I wouldn't yeah. go to the drug dealer and be like, stop selling my husband weed and talk to my husband. I'm like, so why'd you pick up smoking? Yeah. Cause it ultimately like up until that point, I I would be suspicious. It, you you spent the night in the yeah. bathroom, like what you are just you doing? Yeah, like, it was obvious, it's alarming behavior, and that makes sense, but I feel like if you trust your partner, then, now, granted, all of that alarming behavior, maybe she was still skeptical, I guess I couldn't really blame her if that was the case, but if he comes to you and he says, hey, you know, I'm smoking weed, this is the kid that sells me weed, like, you could have tabled that and had a more constructive conversation yep. about it later, mm-hmm. versus going and hunting down and threatening the kid that was like to me that is i feel like she gets picked on and bullied by her family and because of that she feels like she really has to control walter and it's like i get it pregnancy brain you're growing a, another tiny human yeah. inside of you that's a big deal and it affects you in a lot of ways but that doesn't mean you can't have and or respect boundaries and she just fucking leaped over him mm-hmm. fucking catapulted oh yeah she doesn't i mean you saw the whole hand job thing and whatever he she wears the pants in a relationship she controls every aspect of his life and how he does in what he did like food sex everything so yeah and yeah, she went a little psycho there that was yeah and at the worst moment too while he's moving the body like perfect <laughs> moment for her to show up but it's like he's a 50 year old man and if, if you guys have been married for 
how old's their son? I'm assuming at least 16, 17 yeah, years, yeah. if not longer. You still feel like you have to babysit him? Yeah. That like, sucks. Th- I think to me that's an indication of like maybe bigger problems. Yeah. Yep. I don't, know, I don't know how I feel about Skylar's character. I mean, she's a loving wife and mother by the looks of it, but I don't know. Yeah. She's too, a little bit too much for me sometimes. We are shitting on a, on one of the most positive characters of the show. Like, from the point of crime. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. You yeah. know? Oh, she, yeah. you just mean in she, regards to, like, yeah, her yeah, innocence? Yeah. 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 Yes. She's, like, the most yeah. innocent. She's, like, literally, like, the, the most innocent person in the show. But, like, it's so hard, like, not to hate her. Mm-hmm. She's just like, ah! Why are you... Skylar, Skylar, yeah. and who knows? Your guys' opinion might change about her as we keep watching the show. Because, we'll see. Like I said, characters in the show—they're—they are not what they are right now. So they're very they, complex. They're very, very complex. I got um, it. What do you guys think about uh, Walter and the way he is uh, treating um, uh, Crazy Eight? I wish he would uh, just get it over with. Yeah. I wish he would just... It's like you're torturing the guy. I mean, you can't keep him alive and feed him as a pet forever and all that stuff. You need to end this. He started something, yeah. he finished a job. He's avoiding the inevitable. Yeah. yeah, and I really think that is what he's doing. And I think he's just going to make it worse for himself by going to such extents to, to humanize him. You're, you're, you gave him toilet paper. <laughs> and like and sanitizer. sanitizer. Yeah. yeah, like that to me, you're you are meant to kill this man and you are you're just making it harder for yourself. Yep. Because he his health I mean, I'm really surprised it's where it's at. It, from the looks of it, it's only going to improve, especially I mean, not that white bread and bologna is the best diet in the world. No, but but he's obviously not like passed out and wheezing and all that anymore. He's he's getting his like um stamina back and everything. Yeah, like he's able to, to speak and be coherent yeah. and that I think is going to open a can of worms that he's not prepared to deal with because I kind of feel like they might reach a point where he's not going to kill Crazy Eight. I f- he has to, <coughs> he has but to I do don't it. know if he actually will follow through now. I just wish as a chemistry teacher he would poison him somehow. I don't know. So oh, you no. Know, drink your no, drink be the easiest get way. Over. That would be the easiest way. I was yeah. Yeah. Just put too. something so in the balloon. Put some in the food or so, some anything. shit. Yeah. But yeah, anything. man, eat this. Like, when he was giving him food, it was the perfect time to kill him. You know? Yeah, but well, pre- at this stage in the game, this would legally be classified as premeditated murder. Oh, yeah. oh my god! Whereas yes. when he killed Emilio, that was he literally had a gun to your head. Your fight or fight responses kicked in. It would probably for anybody would have been so much more easy in that moment to do it. Now yeah. you're contemplating dosages and things like that. So oh, yeah. yeah, he. I don't know. Maybe Jesse would end up doing it instead. I don't know. Dude, like, just smoke, like, three more meth bowls and... and just Do go it. for it. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that meth, like, whenever he takes it, he kind of gives him more... You saw that. He just, like... Mate! He just, like, all right, let's do this! So what does like, meth do to you? I don't, like... So I remember, like, heroin, I guess, makes you blah. I think heroin... I'm not... Meth, I don't know. Um, I've I don't never know. done meth in my life, so I would not... <laughs> Thank do God. Meth. I've never done meth. <laughs> big, big, big out there. But it's a stimulant. Um, so it does, it kind of gives you a feeling of... Of like, it, it's like an adrenaline rush. Almost. Yeah, it feels like electricity. Like, you you are just electricity. And it increases your your heart rate, your metabolism. Like, that's why meth heads more often than not... you are they, skinny. Yeah. 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 And the, it results in sores over time because you have so much energy. You're moving, you're itching. You can't stop fidgeting. Yeah. Oh, and, meth is those people who do that stuff? Yeah, you oh, get yeah. meth bites. So... Oh, my God. It, I remember because I'm Dave Chappelle. <laughs> you should see some like before and after pictures of meth. Oh, I've seen before. It's pretty, pretty scary. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, uh, we got Walter yeah, White so, making us some pure meth here. Yeah, pure energy. Pure energy. energy you know <laughs> and what I mean? Orange is the, the new black, the, the meth, um, the white girls who are doing meth. Oh, yeah. yeah. Like how their teeth was all like. Mm-hmm. You know, all They're just all like. It does. It just decays your body from yeah. the inside out. Don't do my friends. Don't do it. Drugs are bad. So what are you guys' uh, mm-hmm. what are you, what are you guys' predictions? I don't know where this is gonna go. I mean, I just predict like he's he's gonna keep doing it, keep trying to aim at his goal, make money. Mm-hmm. Um, eventually, somebody or something somehow somebody's gonna find out and try blackmail him. Maybe I'm gonna assume it's gonna go that route. Maybe. I'm thinking that maybe um, once they resolve this situation um, and the money starts coming in, I think that might kind of. I don't like put Skylar on onto a different path. Maybe not necessarily be like, oh my God, where's all this money coming from? But if anything, it should 
she's so concerned about money right now. She's so concerned about the baby that maybe yeah. once her financial woes are um, alleviated, then maybe she won't be so up Walter's ass. But, but uh, she's going to ask him where she got the money and everything. But at the same time, I feel like she's going to enjoy the money and like spend it on like purses and stuff. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean... Know. I don't think so. I don't <laughs> think that's Skylar. Purses, I don't know. Um, or on her writing or something. I don't know. We'll see. She's going to enjoy the money. Yeah, and I mean, she's selling her, her knickknacks and heirlooms and things like that right now. So it's like she clearly she clearly needs it. Yeah. But, uh, I yeah. So, I don't know. I really... This show is going in so many different directions that I really wasn't expecting. Yeah. Um, and it's doing so very quickly that predictions at this stage in the game, it's just kind of up in the air. Anything could happen. I get the, the title now. The cast in the bag. He, he lied. Why he's like buying marijuana instead of, of selling meth. The cat's still in the bag. Mm -hmm. I get it. The yeah. towels are great. Interesting. All right, guys. Anything else? Now just catch our uncast on Patreon. Comment, like, subscribe, and please don't spoil. Yeah, and we're also far ahead also on Patreon as well. So we will see you guys next week. Peace. Bye. Yo, 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 N-O-R, M to the I to the E to the S, representing the normies watching Breaking Bad, biatch. Leave a comment, like, or subscribe, and consider supporting us on Patreon for uncut and early access content. Shout out to the super patrons in yellow, they keep us going every day, and we will see you next week for Breaking Bad.